guys, I'm Nicole, and I'm going to show you how I stay focused working from home. Hey everyone, my name is Adam. I am a uh, media arts and science major at the School of Informatics and Computing at IUPUI. I figured I'd take a second today to just show you guys my workspace and how I'm still managing to get some work done while I'm at home quarantined. Hey guys, my name is Steven, and I'm a video intern at IU Studios. Today, I'm going to be showing off my workspace to hopefully give you some ideas for your own work area at home. Hello everyone, my name is Skate Patel, a computer engineer at IUPUI, and I'm also going to be showing you my workspace. I don't have a desk, so my workspace for the next few weeks is my bed. So this is my desk. This is where I like to get most of my work done. As you can see, there's not a lot of actual working desk space. Um, that's because most of my work is done on the computer, so it's easy to get distracted when all your work is on the computer. Since I edit a lot of videos for both school and my internship, one of the major things I like to have is a large monitor, as you can see here. A large monitor basically just gives you the flexibility to do whatever you want and see everything all at once. So this is my workspace. It's a pretty big desk just because I do like to take notes on paper. So it lets me do that. It gives me enough room to be able to do anything I really need to do. I also have a lot of LED lights just because I like LED lights. I also have some fake plants to be able to look at just in case I can't go outside. And I also have these antibacterial hand wipes in case I need to wipe down my doorknobs. So something I've started doing was writing down everything that I need to get done so I can stay on track of my schoolwork. So I made a things to do list in my planner and it's really nice to look at everything you need to get done because it keeps, it keeps me motivated to keep doing my work because I know working from home can be very distracting, but seeing everything that I need to do has really helped me stay motivated. Something I like to do is just close all the apps that I'm not working in. So if I'm editing a video, I'll uh, close Chrome. I will close all the tabs or I'll close uh, my messages app just to make sure that I'm focusing on that work. And that usually helps me get through um, most of the things I need to do. I also find that having a high quality microphone such as this one is a huge plus, especially considering all of our classes have switched online to Zoom. Having clean, crisp audio is something that everyone in class will appreciate. So another issue that I run into is getting distracted by family members or like pets in the house. So I got crafty and I put my hamper in my suitcase in front of my door because I don't have a lock. So it keeps people out. One tip that I'd like to give everyone is that there are still resources out there for you in case you need them, such as the Bebco Learning Center and the Mac. If you need help on math, go to the Mac website and there should be resources there for you to use. If there's any kind of trouble that you're having in school, especially with online stuff, try and reach out to one of them and they will be able to help you. If working in my room isn't working out for me, I'll usually just take my laptop downstairs and get my work done that way. And that's a nice change of environment that helps me think clearer sometimes and I'll be able to get my work done that way. Hopefully seeing my workspace was able to inspire some of you to create yours. And don't forget to follow IUPUI for more quarantine content in the coming weeks. I hope all these tips help you to work from home. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. So hopefully you guys got something out of these tips. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for watching as always. And I'll see you next time.